All right, Chaser remains the three behind with three from home. Here's your next question. What Samuel Taylor Coleridge character has a long beard and glittering eye? A, the ancient mariner. B, Kubla Khan. C, Christabel. You've put the ancient mariner. Because ancient, beard, mariner, could that mean glittery? Probably. <laughs> <laughs> I see the logic there somewhere. I haven't got a clue. The correct answer is... I'm assist again. Chaser has put. Go to our ancient mariner. I don't know how this is happening. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, yeah, the ancient mariner. Mariner is a sailor. And, oh, uh, so it's not glittery. No. <laughs> but his eye was glittery. Yeah, but under the moonlight, the sea would be glittery. Uh, yeah. I love you. <laughs> Here's your next question. Okay. Which blue Peter pet had the same name as an ancient Jordanian city? A. Shep. B. Willow. C. Petra. Oh, oh please get it wrong. <laughs> You've put. It is Petra's first time. Chaser has put. Goes right also with Petra. OK, you've got three chances of getting through 60, with 60 000. grand. Here we go. Good luck, darling. You've been absolutely wonderful. Here's your question. Oh, please, please, please. <sighs> oh. OK. After helium, what is the next noble gas on the periodic table? A, argon. B, neon. C, xenon. <laughs> Leave an answer, Stace. She knows it. She knows it. OK. No. You've put... You've I think put, I got it wrong. You've put argon. Yeah, and now I think, is argon e even a noble gas? Because yeah. the noble gases are on... They're the ones that don't do much, aren't they? And then you've got, like, the hydrogen on that side, on the bottom. Like, I'm trying to think. Then there's the metals in the middle, then there's the reactive, non-reactive, and I can't... <laughs> OK. <laughs> to go through the 60 grand, the correct answer is... Oh, it's not that. What do you think it is, then, if it ain't that? Xenon, maybe. Or neon. <laughs> I don't know, yeah. OK, neon. staying where you are. Chase has put. She'll get this and close the gap to two. Here she comes. And does indeed. Moves them in two. Um, OK. This is so scary. Here is your next question. Two chances of getting through. Good luck. <sighs> what is the name of the US president's address to Congress each January? A. Update of the state. B. State of the union. Or C. The state we're in. <laughs> <laughs> You've put... No. Oh, no, I don't know. I'm don't sorry. Worry, I'm sorry. Don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. You put update to the state. To go through with 60 grand, the correct answer is... <laughs> it is State of the Union. Oh. Stay where you are. Chaser has put... Goes with it. Moves okay. the room one. We're one from home. Now it's a shootout. Here we go. Here we go. <sighs> the song lyric, I'm gonna be your number one, appears... In what Blondie number one hit? A, Call Me. B, Heart of Glass. C, The Tide is High. Oh, yeah, I know it. Oh, I know it. I know it. Oh! Oh! Oh, yeah, I think I got it. No, I don't know. You've put... You've put... To go through with 60 grand. The correct answer is. <laughs> now then, let me tell you, Stacey Solomon, you have just beaten the number two female quizzer on the planet. <laughs> that makes me the number one. 
That makes you the number one. You've got it. It's an educated guess. Um, it's the name of a restaurant near us that I quite like. <laughs> <laughs> That's as good as it gets with me, Brad. <laughs> <laughs> Correct answer is... Oh! <laughs> Step closer. It's the Irish blood. Michelangelo it is. Chaser has put go wrong. Come on, missus, go wrong. Oh! Yes! <laughs> Come on! Here's your next question with three ahead. 